Hi guys, in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to uh, record a response in Flipgrid. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is you will log into your grid. So I've got my grid here that I've already uh, received the link to. Um, this is a practice grid that I created. And then I have to decide which topic. It all automatically launched me into one of the topics that are available on the grid. Um, there are actually three topics I could choose from on the sample grid that I created. And so I'm just gonna stick with this first topic. This first topic is a built-in one in Flipgrid when you create a, um, a grid. And so you may see this in other grids that you go to. I mean, it's just that first one that's just like a welcome, hi, how are you? And so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to scroll down and click the plus sign, okay, to record a response. And then it's gonna prompt me, do I want to allow it to use uh, my camera and my microphone? Now, in this case, I've already done some flip grids on this computer before, so it's not necessarily gonna ask me to do that right now. Now I've got some options. And if I want some stickers to appear in my video, let's say I don't want my face to show up in the video. I could actually take a sticker, let's say I wanna do this one, and I can use it to cover my face because maybe I don't feel comfortable being on camera. Or let's say I really like, there's a, a lightning one that I really like. Oops. So if I want a lightning bolt just in the background while I'm recording, I can do that. Now all this should be done before you start recording. You can also type in words, like if I wanted it to say awesome. Um, and there are a couple of different options that you can use um, throughout this, play around with the different features of it. Um, but this is just the basics. So once I've got any other images, any other things I want to show up while I'm recording, then I hit the record button, it gives you a countdown, and now I'm recording a video. So it's getting everything that I'm recording right now locked in. Now this one is a minute and 30 seconds. So it's showing up in the upper right hand corner how much time I have available to record my message. Once I've recorded everything I feel like I need to record, I can click next. Now let's say I realized, oh, you know what? I completely forgot one more thing I wanted to add. You can click add more. Oh, and I also forgot to mention this and it will add on to your video, and then click Next. You also have options to um, play around with different editing, uh, how you want to um, crop it, that sort of thing. Um, but again, these are just basic. So I've recorded my video message, I've added extra because I wanted to add some extra. Now it's gonna take a selfie. The selfie is just the piece of the video that is gonna be the image that people can click on. So it's just like the little thumbnail. So all I do is I can, again, same features, add stickers. So again, if I want that lightning bolt on there, maybe I wanna be like Harry Potter and get that little lightning bolt scar on my forehead, give a little thumbs up. There you go. Now that is my image that's gonna show up on the Flipgrid grid. And then it's compiling the video, it's getting it all ready to go. You can change your name. You can add a title. And then we're ready to submit. Yay, it's available, it's on there. I'm done, there we go. So there's two samples. Now, let's say that you also want to respond to someone else's. You can actually click on uh, one of the videos and then click this reply button. The reply button allows you to go through all the exact same steps, only in this case, you're writing a response or recording a response video to the first video. So I would say something like, hey Josh, I just saw that video. That looked really awesome. You're really cool. And again, you can do all the same features you did the last time. Take a selfie. Click next. And then the person who posted that original response will get a notification that, hey, someone responded to your post and you can carry on a conversation uh, with that. So you can respond to someone else's. All right, and that is it. That's how you do a quick post in Flipgrid and reply to another post. All right, that is all I've got for this. Till next time, book forward and be awesome. Bye guys.